Hey guys. So today is my third day in a fibro flare that is severely affecting my hands. I'm not going to lie to you, they fucking hurt. <laughs> Today's to-do list, because no one else is going to get it done, is as follows. I've got an appointment at 10 o'clock to a place I've never been, to meet people I've never met, never spoken to, and have I, I have no idea what's going on at all, none. I've got to get the washing in off the line. Make a roast dinner and prep food for the week, which means cleaning the stove in the kitchen first. Get my small space gardening video filmed and edited and ready to upload while I'm sleeping because some old dick up the road has decided that we're not allowed to have proper internet because he doesn't want it, even though the rest of the street wants it. I've got to write up 20 recipes because the rest of my week is pretty much taken up for a printable that I have to have ready to go in my Etsy shop for 4 p.m. on Friday. I can't even get my boots on, I'm struggling. I can't, it hurt, my hands hurt too much to even pull my boots on. I'm actually considering going to my appointment without my boots on, going barefoot just to prove a point. What? I am sick and tired of people and doctors and government bodies and people who are meant to help us say, you need to pace yourself. Get someone else to do it. Who? Are they going to come to my house and do it for me? Because from what I've been told that unless I'm allowed to have, I'm, I'm willing to have someone come to my house and shower me, um... I can't get any help. Besides which, if I don't do it, who else is going to bloody do it? Because no one else is going to do it. No, I don't take all the pain meds I can. Because I can't. Because I'm allergic to most of them. 98% of them I can't take. And the ones I can take, I need how to take for three days. Because they're so highly damaging and so highly bloody addictive that... I'm not allowed to take them for more than three days. Oh, and I'm out at the moment, by the way. I don't have any because it takes nine weeks to get into to see the doctor. Um, they're not on repeat prescription because of the level of painkiller that they are. And I have to go in and see them and sign for them every single time. So I have to learn to live with it and I have to learn to function in the best way it can. Yes, I have written this out because... It started off as a rant on Facebook. <sighs> My daily pain is like, you know, one of those Sherman tanks that runs over monster trucks for a warm up. That's my baseline every day. I think if I woke, I got to the stage now where if I wake up one morning and I'm not in pain, I'm gonna think I'm dead. <laughs> So if I say I'm not hurting today, it means that I have no extra pain today. It doesn't mean that I'm not in pain. It means that I have my baseline pain that I always have. And I'm not moaning. I'm just explaining. I'm just asking for some thought before telling me off because I've used the wrong words or laughing at me because I've used the wrong words. I'm asking for some thought before telling me off for getting my... or just not remembering something that you want me to remember because I've got ADHD too don't forget that and autism but that's not about this this is about chronic pain I'm asking for some thought that I may not be up for doing your stuff because I can't even keep up with mine I'm asking for some help without asking for it because I won't ask you because I'm used to doing it all by myself. So I may as well just keep doing it all by myself. 
I'm asking for some consideration before giving me a scolding in front of your mates because instead of saying, be at mine at 8 a.m., I need extra time to get ready, I asked, what time are you going to be here? I'm just asking that for once, just once, someone around here thinks about me for a change and are not so bloody self-absorbed and selfish, can't see what's right in front of them. And I'm asking that everyone stop gaslighting myself and others like me, because you don't understand what we go through on a daily basis just to survive. I love you guys, apes.